If you or someone in your family uses a credit card, a decision had to be made about whether you could be trusted to pay back the money you charge. That decision depends on the work of a credit analyst. A credit analyst examines the financial statements and credit history of individuals or companies. Based on that information, the analyst determines the degree of risk involved in extending credit or lending money. Credit analysts often work for banks and other financial institutions, though any corporation that extends credit might employ one or more. For example, manufacturing concerns might run credit checks on customers before starting to make products to make sure that customer has a history of paying on time. Susan, can you run a credit report on John who's requested a, a loan from us? It's a job that requires careful consideration of information and the ability to prepare a clear, objective report. The decisions must be made on facts, not instinct, so a credit analyst must be able to focus on details, hour after hour and day after day. The working conditions are usually very comfortable, with an office and a standard 40-hour work week the norm. A bachelor's degree is the most common source of training. College graduates with business-related degrees can move easily into these positions, but it can be a position for which training is available on the job. A key part of the nation's economy runs smoothly when this job is done well. Without credit, in fact, much of the economy would grind to a halt. Houses wouldn't be built, tuitions wouldn't be paid, cars wouldn't be bought. The list goes on and on. To continue the flow of credit, analysts consider whether it's safe to loan the money case by case.